GVOL's educational series. Today we're going to talk about the DeFi options protocol Zeta, which is built on Solana. Zeta DeFi options are European cash settled margin options. Zeta is built using Serum, the global central order book of the Solana ecosystem to facilitate DeFi options trading. One of the big selling points of building on Solana is that Solana block times are 400 milliseconds. The throughput is up to 50,000 transactions per second and the gas fees are very cheap. These selling points of building on the Solana ecosystem allow market makers to refresh quotes across the order book several times per second, and it allows the internal Zeta risk engine to monitor for any options that are under collateralized that may be subject to liquidation. When putting on a new position, DeFi traders need to meet the initial margin requirements in order to open a new position. Once that position is open, DeFi traders need to maintain maintenance margin requirements. One of the big issues when monitoring maintenance margin requirements and options is that sometimes the market can become very thin and that forces the bid and the ask prices to become very far apart or completely gone altogether. And how does the risk engine know the true value of these options? The Zeta protocol maintains an internal volatility surface in order to keep internal fair value marks. This allows the risk engine to reference fair value markets despite the market becoming thin or bids and offers completely disappearing. We need these marks in order to determine which options are under collateralized and which traders are subject to liquidation. The Zeta protocol starts with an internal moneyness surface. This internal moneyness surface has five points to it. At the money, down 25%, down 50%, up 25%, up 50%. There's interpolation between these points and this sets the initial marks. As new trades come into the market or the order book markets move, the internal volatility surface of Zeta will update. There's also the component of interest rates. Interest rates are going to be determined by the trading difference of the futures price versus the underlying spot price. The underlying spot price is piped in from the Pyth network. Pyth is an Oracle system built on Solana. Taken together, all these variables allow for the internal risk engine to continuously monitor for under collateralized options. This leads us to potential liquidations. When an options or futures position becomes subject to liquidation because the DeFi trader failed to meet maintenance margin requirements, there's gonna be the ability for a third party to come in and assume those positions and earn a discount reward in the form of a discount to the maintenance margin. Zeta protocol sets this discount reward to 35% of the maintenance margin. Should liquidations fail to happen in a timely manner and losses exceed equity of traders, an insurance fund has been set up in order to make traders whole. The insurance fund is gonna be funded on day one with a certain amount of capital but also continuously funded from trading fees on the Zeta protocol. The Zeta trading fees are 0% for makers and 30 basis points for takers. Finally, should losses deplete the insurance fund completely, remaining losses will be socialized. All the remaining traders will take a haircut to their account balance to make up for the losses of the system that have been exceeded. On day one of the Zeta protocol launch, Zeta plans to launch two weekly expiries with matching futures, 11 strike prices per expiration on the Solana dollar price underlier. 
These options are set to expire on Friday, 8 a.m. UTC with a multiplier of one. Ultimately, the goal of the Zeta protocol is to enable options on many different altcoins all in one place. Finally, Zeta also plans to launch flexible options, which allow any third party to come in and determine a non-standard expiration on a non-standard underlier with a non-standard strike and create bespoke options which can be auctioned into the market. Altogether, Zeta aims to provide the robustness of a centralized exchange experience with the versatility of a decentralized landscape. I hope you found this video helpful. And remember, find edge, capture alpha, and slang size.